Hello, Unreal 5.7 was released a couple weeks ago and it's got lots of great new stuff. I personally use Unreal to make cinematics, so I'm more concerned with features that increase image quality. If you're a game developer, you may have different priorities. But from an Unreal filmmaker's perspective like me, what's new and exciting in this new release? Well, Megalites enters beta. This is like Nanite for lights. You might remember the impressive tech demo of this from last year where they showed a scene with over a thousand shadow casting lights in a single scene. Well, this update improves quality, reduces noise, it boosts performance and adds new features such as support for hair strands, translucency, directional lights, and Niagara particle lights. Now, the not so good is that performance scales heavily with your internal resolution, so higher res equals much more expensive render times. It's still hardware ray tracing, so tons of instances, overlapping lights, or dynamic geometry will hurt render times. Directional lights work, but only for soft moonlight style lighting. Those sharp sun shadows might get a bit too soft for you and may also cause some ghosting artifacts in your interiors. Niagara lights should also be set with small attenuation to keep performance from tanking and to keep too many lights from hitting the same pixel. Still unsupported in 5.7 for mega lights is forward shading, cloud shadows, subsurface thickness, water, clouds, heterogeneous volumes, and local volumetrics. So Megalites looks like it might be something to at least start playing with, but maybe not appropriate for all scenes yet. 